हेलो एवरी वन वन गुड मॉर्निंग टू ऑल ऑफ यू वुड लाइक टू वेलकम टू आवर यूट्यूब चैनल होप यू ऑल आर गुड सो एज मैंसन ऑन द स्क्रीन विल डिस्कस पॉलिटिकल आइडियोलॉजी विद इन इट सोशलिज्म पॉलिटिकल आइडियोलॉजी नेक्स्ट टू द लिबरलिज्म एट इट्स गोइंग टू इम्पोर्टेंट फॉर ऑल दो आर प्रिपेयरिंग फॉर एस एस पी पी जी टी टी जी टी वी सी नेट पी एच डी एंट्रेंस एंड ऑल सो एज विथ द रिपीटेशन दैट विल फास्ट डिस्कस द प्रिवियस और क्वेश्चन विथ रेस्पेक्ट टू सोशियालीजम अंडर दैट बेसिस वी विल कवर द थियोरी एंड कन्सेप्ट हुई गोइंग टू इम्पोर्टेंट फॉर आवर एग्जामेसन सो ऑन दिस नोट लेट स्टार्ट ओके एस सोशियालीजम एज आई डिड मेनसन सो बिफोर मुविंग टू द आइडिया ऑफ सोशियालीजम लेट्स go back to the homework question uh, which did i provide the last in the last session so question is who coined the term harm principle option a john locke b bentham c angels d none of the above so what is the answer so before like the declaration of answer let me clarify one thing that as i request to you that you should provide the answer in comment section but the thing is that no one is interest to participate so i think that i should not provide any kind of homework question it's up to you that how you will prefer so come to the answer so harm principle concept is given by your jess mill and in our option no mention of jess mill so option d is the answer okay so let's start the socialism concept and its previous or question and on that basis we will try to cover the pyq so first question in front of you the word social from which the term socialist has been derived belongs to option a latin language greek language german language and french language so the answer like option a latin language okay so latin language the word for the social okay for the socialist word so here the basic thing that uh, the like word its origins and the the word first time used by whom okay that are the probable chance of the question moving to the next question the concept social statistification satisfaction hints at uh, social equality a uh, just social order social hierarchy and social stability so social satisfaction deals with a just social order as we have already discussed these things that just social order can be ensured with the help of social satisfaction with a, satisfy the need and the requirement of every section of the society moving to the next question who is considered to be a utopian socialist before this question would like to address the learning from this question because our objective to learn from the question so we need to focus the principles and basic idea with respect to different ideology be it your socialism and so on so who is next question who is considered to be a utopian socialist option a robert oben b forbach c rojne dean fredericks so utopian socialist the answer of this question option a robert oben considered as the utopian socialist what does it mean so within the uh, umbrella ideology like socialism i will call it umbrella ideology because there under it different types of socialism you found okay as per the time to time there are the a number of type of socialism found and utopian socialist is out of that which consider the past or the early socialist we will discuss that thing its thinker and its basic idea moving to the next question these are above comes under your ssv question now i will going to demonstrate before you the uses in at puiq because it help to you the conceptual understanding based question let's start with it without delay consider the following uh, and choose incorrect okay choose incorrect option a socialism stand for equality 
सोशलिज्म स्टैंड फॉर कलेक्शन ऑफ प्राइवेट प्रॉपर्टी सोशलिज्म स्टैंड फॉर एलिमिनेशन ऑफ कंपटीशन सोशलिज्म ए मेट एलिमिनेशन ऑफ द कैपिटलिज्म सो हियर द ऑप्शन बी बी इज बेसिकली इनकरेक्ट बिकॉज सोशलिज्म नॉट स्टैंड फॉर प्राइवेट प्रॉपर्टी द रैशनल बिफोर ओरिजिन ऑफ सोशलिज्म इज टू काउंटर द प्राइवेट प्रॉपर्टी टू काउंटर द इंडस्ट्रियल सोसाइटी ओके टू काउंटर द कैपिटालीजम टू काउंटर द कैपिटालीजम ओके टू काउंटर द कंपिटिशन इन इक्वालिटी सो फ्रम दिस क्वेश्चन वी लर्न दैट वी नीड टू कवर द प्रिंसिपल और बेसिक कोर ऑफ़ द सोशलिज्म आइडियोलॉजी मूविंग टू द नेक्स्ट क्वेश्चन सोशल डेमोक्रेसी कंबाइंस द एलिमेंट ऑफ लिबरालिज्म एंड सोशलिज्म टू रिकनसाइल द फ्रीडम एंड इक्वालिटी स्टेटमेंट सेकेंड सोशल डेमोक्रेटिक रिजिम्स यूज द सिस्टम ऑफ न्यू कॉर्पोरेटिज्म पॉलिसी मेकिंग इन्वॉल्व द स्टेट लेबर एंड बिजनेस सो फास्ट ऑप्शन कम टू द फास्ट स्टेटमेंट सोशल डेमोक्रेसी कंबाइन एलिमेंट्स ऑफ लिबरालिज्म एंड सोशलिज्म टू रिकनसाइल फ्रीडम एंड इक्वालिटी येस इट्स करेक्ट वेन यू टॉक अबाउट सोशलिज्म देर इज ए कन्सेप्ट ऑफ इवोल्यूशनरी सोशलिज्म एंड विद इन दैट वी स्टडी द डेमोक्रेटिक सोशलिज्म और सोशल डेमोक्रेसी which not only include the idea of equality or idea of the social ownerships but also it include the freedom of speech and the thought expression free competitions also okay so the concept of freedom you can also find there so it reconcile the both idea of liberalism along with socialism the first statement is correct we will discuss that thing when we will discuss the different type of socialism then moving to the second statement social democratic regime used the system of new corporatism marking policy making the involve of state and labor business so it is a uh, portrayed the aspect of inclusiveness in the socialism or the social democratic or the democratic socialism in which in the not only include only the state mechanism or say for example the elites but also the labor union the interest group and the business community because the public policy is all about the representing the interest of the people and it include business community labor community and along with the our the elected representative so that is how the both statement are correct and from this question we learn that we have uh, to very clear the the idea the concept the depth knowledge of socialism okay uh, then moving to the next point uh, which one of the following is not correct match okay correct not correct match option a fabian fabianism peaceful change b guild socialism professionals then c syndicalism trade unionism uh, representations d democratic socialism uh, radical change so what is not correctly match so like option d is answer because democratic socialism when you talks about democratic socialism there is no revolutionary or radical change or in a single stroke but it includes the aspect of evolutionary the step by step the peaceful way the gradual change that is the principle of the democratic socialism so these are the fabian socialism guild socialism syndicalism democratic socialism these are different types of socialism under the evolutionary socialism and our main objective from this the number of question we have to focus very seriously the type of socialism and different principle of on of the different type of socialism and the thinker we will discuss in depth regarding all the principle which is going to helpful for our examination okay so this is all about your professor question and we try to understand the the pattern of question the need of the our preparation and now we are going to uh, like uh, discuss our theory hope you all agree and if you like my effort and my uh, dedication uh, as we continuously putting has been putting the video so please 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 subscribe our channel if you are new and without liking if you are still watching please like the channels so sorry for the disturbance let's start our discussion of the theory here so first like here the what we will learn okay after the lesson what the outcome you will get okay you will get the basic introduction of the socialism you will get the 
why socialism as a political ideology emerge as i did mention that each and every ideology originate against the existing ideology or the uh, dominant ideology then we will discuss the type of socialism and the timeline okay uh, as last session we have discussed liberalism and its timeline okay then we will discuss the difference between the revolutionary socialism and evolutionary socialism because socialism as a umbrella ideology and within it different types are things then types of evolutionary socialism our main focus of the today topics then we will lastly uh, discuss as we always discuss thinker and contribution so hope you all uh, like uh, get the crisp idea of the uh, our sessions so let's start first introduction okay first introduction first point is that socialism a word derived from the latin word socer which means share simply you can get a question that socialism the word derived from which word so it is the latin word and what does it mean to share okay to sharing to share okay okay the like uh, that is the when i like discuss the socialism it is about sharing it about the uh, like uh, social ownerships okay it is about the common ownerships there is no private property okay social legitim the core is like social ownership of resource social justice and its equality and there is no private property okay it it denounces the private property okay so do remember that thing there is no privatization you will found under the socialism as ideology it believes the idea social ownership of resource this resource belong to the society belong to the community okay and social justice the need fulfill the need of the society and it ensure the equality and like eliminate the private property okay that is the idea and second point is that the word socialism first used by robert oben okay so robert oben used the term socialism first so can be asked directly then why it is the socialism originate it is a counter ideology to capitalism do remember and we know what is capitalism capitalism believes on market economy okay uh, the the private uh, property okay uh, then it also talks about the uh, limited role of the states that is how we understand capitalism when it talks about the liberalism and the capitalism is it talks about industrial the society and that society the inequality origin and there is a uh, like a, a problem for human society that's why socialism as a counter ideology to the capitalism uh, uh, originated with the idea of social ownership social justice and equity so if this part is clear then we'll switch to like the next point is, socialism is an umbrella ideology under which different typology comes uh, as per the time to time okay socialism is a umbrella ideology it's a movement okay it's a movement and series of uh, movement are take place with the name of different uh, type of socialism okay and this table is going to help you the timeline of the type of socialism and its basic feature so for example if i talk about the first is the early socialist and utopian socialist originate in 19th century okay so originate in 19th century that means your 18 okay early 18 okay early 18th century then thinker is known as utopian socialist why they known as utopian socialist okay they can be asked so why the uh, utopian socialist okay uh, it consider as the early socialist utopian socialist because according to the karl marx and engels the socialist early socialist present the counter idea to capitalism without having proper scientifical analysis or the structural uh, uh, structural established presentations okay that's why they consider utopian socialist are very uh, inorganized uh, uh, the idea okay and the proponents who consider as utopian socialist they are robert oben okay charles fourier pj pradhan and saint simon okay 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 so this is the the thinker who belongs to the early socialist and we discuss the, the what does it mean by utopian socialist and why then moving to the scientific socialism first the utopian socialism after that to counter this utopian socialist idea or revise the utopian socialist idea there is a scientific socialism before that would like to take you for example in indian national congress within indian national congress there is a moderator leader and there is a extreme leader 
द एक्सट्रीम लीडर प्रेजेंट दियर आइडिया एगेन्स्ट द मडरेट लीडर लाइक अरविंद घोष प्रेजेंट द आइडिया एगेन्स्ट योर हूम लाइक स्कोलर अफ योर द मडरेट लीडर गोपाल गोष्ठ गोख्याल सिमिलरली हिर विदिन दिस सोशियालीजम देर इज ए अर्ली सोशियालीस्ट हू प्रेजेन्ट्स अनअर्गानाइज आइडिया बट द सैंटिफिक सोशियालीजम क्रिटिसाइज दैट एंड प्रेजेन्ट दियर आइडिया ओके ओके ओरिजिन इन मिड नाइनटीन सेंचुरी विथ द रईट अफ कालमार्क्स एंड एंजेल्स सो सैंटिफिक सोशियालीजम कालमार्क्स एंड एंजेल इट्स अल्सो नोन एज रिभल्यूशनरी सोशियालीजम और मार्क्सीजम सोशियालीजम बिकज दे बिलिवस द रिभल्यूशनरी क्लास स्ट्रगल भाओलेन्स ओके एंड मेन क्रक्स इज अफ इट द सिंगल स्ट्रोक टू ब्रिंग द सोसाइटाल चेंज इन ए सिंगल स्ट्रोक इन ए भेरी क्विक और फास्ट एंड जस्ट किलिंग द कैपिटालीस्ट एंड यू विल बी ब्रिंग द सोशियालीजम देर अंडरस्टांडिंग एंड वर्किंग क्लास एज एन ओनली फोर्स ओके एंड देर मुवमेंट इज ओनली ओनली लिमिटेड टू द वर्किंग क्लास देन इफ यू टॉक अबाउट इवोल्यूशनरी सोशियालीजम दे आर ऑल्सो काउंटर टू द साइंटिफिक सोशियालीजम ओके फास्ट वी डिस्कस अर्ली सोशियालीस्ट देन काउंटर टू द टू काउंटर इट साइंटिफिक सोशियालीजम देन टू काउंटर द साइंटिफिक सोशियालीजम आइडिया देर इज ए इवोल्यूशनरी सोशियालीजम If you will ask, sir, the type of socialism and within that there are the different socialism counter to each other because they their main idea is the main goal is the to achieve the socialism or the social ownership, but they adopt the different means and the method while countering each and every idea. Like we study the dialectic, the dialectical method talks about the what there is a uh, the what. the negation then there is a contradiction then there is a synthesis okay synthesis so similarly the things dialectical process they uh, take place with the evolution of the better kind of system as i already provided the example of the congress okay evolution socialism origin in the last 19th century and known as the democratic socialism okay and here we will try to differentiate the scientific socialism or revolutionary socialism between and the evolutionary socialism so democratic socialism and it believe the peaceful change gradual change step by step your democratic socialism believes the constitutional method believes the peaceful way okay and uh, the middle class also the part of the movement so here the evolutionary socialism idea not only uh, include the working class interest but also the middle class interest and george bernard sir gd cole they are the main proponent of evolution socialism say for example within the like uh, your uh, the congress the indian national congress with respect to india there is a scholar like your bal gangadhar tilak along with the scholar like gopal gustav gokhel so here uh, like bal gangadhar tilak present the idea of the violence and uh, the different thing that you know like grand murder case and this is a violent activity by the bal gangadhar tilak similarly here also the scientific socialism by karl marx and engels they present a revolutionary idea they present a bloody revolution but on other hand evolutionary socialism came with idea of democratic change we should do bring the socialism idea with the help of the a peaceful way with the help of the gradual process step by steps so that is their idea which they consile the the idea of liberalism along with the socialism so this is how the basic difference of we seen the scientific socialism and evolutionary socialism now we will switch to the cultural socialism it's very easy to understand origin during the early 20th century with the writing of the antonio gramsci so antonio gramsci is a socialist thinker and his idea based on cultural socialism or cultural marxism and his major idea cultural hegemony we will discuss in other video new marxism new marxism are origin during the mid 20th and early 20th century okay late 20th century as a narrative of human emancipation okay they criticized the karl marx idea of uh, the sub base and superstructure and the idea theory of class struggles moving to the next point it originated against exploitation by the post capitalism uh, lead welfare states so why the new marxism is originated the rational before new marxism it criticized the welfare states it criticized the post capitalist society and analyzed the exploitation exploitations take place during the post capitalist society or welfare states like in the contemporary 
era we living in the new marxism society or the welfare states still there is exploitation exist for example in manipur although we are living in a welfare state but violence also exist in manipur also exist in different part of the our country so new marxism try to critically analyze that thing and the thinker can be asked so jojen habermas new marxism scholar herbert marcus theodor adorno eric from walter benjamin and frederick polak so these are the scholar and with the with this note we would cover we had completed the type of socialism and its basic feature okay so here the major thing gonna cover moving to the next we have to discuss the type of evolutionary socialism because we just have a look that we did look a types of socialism different thing the evolutionary revolutionary early and new marxism culture now we will see the evolutionary socialism as you as you notice read the question this is the comes under evolutionary socialism and that i am going to discuss with you the types of evolutionary socialism so the type of evolutionary socialism and this side is the basic feature the fabian socialism okay fabian socialism is the first democratic systematic form of socialism with marked year of late 19th century origin in england so fabian socialism was originated in england in the year 19th century okay and it is a form of democratic socialism it believes the gradual change democratic way okay and it include the middle middle class okay so main argument of fabian socialism the peaceful change to change the existing society through the peaceful way through the democratic way through the like uh, uh, the like elections okay through the process of uh, the uh, political competition okay so that is their main argument they unlike the karl marx idea they believe the idea of a peaceful way to bring the socialism idea with the help of the democratic provision and the important thinker can be asked gb saha gram walls sydney web betrick web and gdh coal so they are the prominent scholar to the fabian socialism then moving to the next if it is clear we will switch to the next the german social democracy so german social democracy is also a types of uh, evolutionary socialism which emerged in germany but in the fabian socialism which emerged in england do remember they can simply ask the question may choose incorrect and correct pair fabian socialism originated in england german social democracy in german by name it clear okay and support the concept of political party with the democratic way okay if you remember karl marx did not support political party okay okay but your evolutionary socialism like german social democracy they support the political party they can ask and they believe the political party with the help of the constitutional and the legislation or democratic way can ensure the interest of working class or middle class with the peaceful way okay that is their argument and they support the marxist doctrine of economic interpretation of history but they don't include the dem- the revolutionary concept or the bloody revolution of karl marx they did not support the bloody revolution of karl marx but they support marxist doctrine of economic interpretation what does it mean that how the society are changed from one uh, type of uh, uh, like society to the another for example how the society changed from the uh, slave to feudal feudal to capitalism and capitalism to the socialism so that is the historical interpretation of the economic that they support the german social democracy and the important scholar ferdinand lasswells okay ferdinand lasswells the proponent of german social democracy then come to the revisionism revisionism is a type of evolutionary socialism which originates in germany only okay do remember germany and your scholar is edward bernstein okay and the revisionism socialism criticizes the karl marx futuristic interpretation okay okay so they consider the uh, the idea of karl marx are totally like uh, uh, wrong okay because to karl marx uh, in future the peasant will be disappear the middle class will disappear uh, the uh, like uh, the problem in society will be higher okay okay uh, so this kind of things are not uh, 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 observed in the uh, contemporary times okay uh, that the 
counter idea observed in this contemporary times so that's why they criticize the karl marx idea are not prevalent or not uh, uh, like uh, prominent in the contemporary times so that's why the revisionism criticize the marx karl marx futuristic predictions okay and so uh, they consider they consider socialism as a movement not as an end goal okay if you remember karl marx talks about the socialism the communism as a like end but revisionism consider socialism as a movement it's not a end goal and it it it, it changes according to the time to time okay sometimes scientific socialism sometimes it's evolutionary socialism and within that there are different type of socialism okay then moving to the next the syndicalism so syndicalism originated in france simply they can ask the question the syndicalism socialism originated where it plans and they support the strong trade unionism okay so according to them the strong trade unionism will ensure the interest of a working class okay will protect the working class and ensure the socialism and they basically support the class struggle theory of karl marx okay they support the class struggle theory of karl marx that means they don't support the idea of political party if you see in german social democracy they support idea of political party but syndicalism did not support the idea of political party and the main idea of it socialization without the state they believe that we will do the socialization or socialism but there is no requirement of the state so that kind of anarchy tendency you can find in syndicalism and uh, main supporter is the fordland polter okay here you can see fordland polter but in the german social democracy you will see fordland laswell okay moving to the next the guild socialism last not the least uh, the type of as a type of evolution socialism they originate in england simply you can get a question guild socialism originate where so it is england and they extend the syndicalism by reconcile the interest of worker and customer okay your guild socialism not only include the interest of working class or trade unionism but also reconcile both worker and customers interest okay worker and customer interest it more based on idea of professionalism that those are doing the professional job they will be comes under the idea of guild because guild is a system where the people are mutual cooperate okay the people are doing the trade business but also same time they mutually cooperate okay okay and it believes the also the class struggle like the syndicalism and the scholar gdh cole with this note we did successfully cover the types of evolutionary socialism be it your fabian german social uh, revisionism syndicalism and gdh cole hope you clear about the type evolutionary type of evolutionary socialism then the last slide not the least that the thinker and their contribution that the thinker like here you will see robert oben the book the new view of society society okay then magazine is the cooperative magazine cooperative magazine by robert oben then edward bonnstein the wrote a book evolutionary socialism belong to the german social democracy then charles fourier the new industrial world uh, belongs to the idea of utopian socialist जेडी एच कोल द सोशलिजम इन इवोल्यूशन द बुक एंड जोसेफ ए सुम्पिटर कैपिटालीजम सोशलिजम एंड डेमोक्रेसी अ बुक ओके एंड ही लाइक प्रेजेंट द लाइक द व्हाट डज इट मीन बाय सोशलिजम ओके इन हिज बुक कैपिटालीजम सोशलिजम डेमोक्रेसी सो दिस इज द थिंकर एंड द बुक दैट दे कैन आस द क्वेश्चन मैच ऑफ द फॉलोइंग और करेक्ट इन करेक्ट फेयर सो विद दिस नोट वी डिड सक्सेसफुल कवर ऑल द थिंग्स विच Uh, comes under our idea of socialism with respect to examination L on the basis of previous or question hope you are found it interesting and valuable with this note would like to end and before ending the class uh, there was there is a uh, homework question as i said that uh, you are not ready to participate and uh, sometime with frustration i uh, like said that i will not provide but mind you responsibility that provide homework question it's up to you that you whether participate or not okay so question is that choose incorrect pair option a leon trotsky the revolution betrayed option b betrick wave industrial democracy then option c antonio crossland the fabian essay in socialism and d none of the above so you need to find the incorrect pair which is the incorrect pair and you need to provide the answer in comment section and those will provide the correct answer i will try to acknowledge their name in the next class so hope you all uh, clear okay if you found it uh, 
लाइक इंटरेस्टिंग वैल्यूएबल ओके डू सब्सक्राइब आवर चैनल इफ यू लाइक आवर एफर्ट ओके डू लाइक आवर चैनल एंड प्रेस द बेल आइक ऑन एज मार्क ऑफ योर अटेंडेंस एंड डू जॉइन द टेलीग्राम आई डी दैट इज तापस कुमार प्रधान की पाठशाला देर यू विल गेट द पी डी एफ द इम्पोर्टाट नोटिस नोटिफिकेसन विथ रेस्पेक्ट टू एस एस बी एंड अल्सो आई अजुआल यूज टू सेयर द करेन्ट एफेयर रिलेटेड इनफर्मेसन विथ रेस्पेक्ट टू आवर एक्जामेसन सो प्लीज डू जॉन द तापस कुमार प्रधान की पाठशाला द टेलीग्राम आई डी सो विथ दिस नोट उड लाइक टू एंड दिस लेक्चर होप यू फाउंड इट वैल्यूएबल इंटरेस्टिंग एंड थैंक यू सो मच फॉर बींग पार्ट ऑफ दिस लेसन थैंक यू गाइज सेवन एस टाइम